Well, and Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon is with us. Albert, uh, you know, as hard and difficult as the cold is to deal with, just moments ago you were talking to us in a commercial break about the next challenge for folks, especially right. in a state like Texas when it starts to thaw out um, the potential for pipes bursting. Power crisis now, temperatures go above freezing, and then we start to have a water crisis. And there are communities in Texas that are either under water boil notice or no water at all. And that situation may get aggravated actually as the temperatures again recover above freezing. And another storm system on the map tonight. It's moving through North Texas, Oklahoma with snow, freezing rain coming in out of West Texas into Central Texas. Marty mentioned now about a half a million customers in the Austin area without power, about 60% of the uh, people that are a part of Austin Energy and another swath of freezing rain headed in right, right now. So it's insult to injury and additional winter weather is expected even on Thursday. So winter storm warnings are in effect right now. South Texas extending into western areas of Tennessee, central Tennessee, all the way to New England with a winter storm watch in effect. Same system is going to be producing ice and several inches of snow from Texas and New England over the next few days. And on top of that, same system could kick up severe weather. So tomorrow afternoon and evening, a severe weather threat, including in New Orleans and Mobile, Alabama. It's a two out of five on the severe weather scale. Isolated tornadoes as well as thunderstorms producing damaging wind and hail will all be a threat. There's a look at the weather map. It's busy system in the morning in Texas and by tomorrow evening it's in the northeast spreading wintry mix and snow multiple inches of snow again six plus inches of snowfall from Oklahoma into portions of the northeast and New England that extends again into Thursday something we'll be watching in the days to come Rob.